familiar corner of Trumbull and Asylum in downtown Hartford, where fans are filing into the XL Center to see the first Big East Conference game of the season for UConn women's basketball. It's UConn taking on the Butler Bulldogs live on SNY with a record of 7-3 and three, and their conference opener as well. So UConn in the home whites, Butler in their road blues, and we're underway in downtown Hartford. Here's Mule to the corner. Three to open the scoring for UConn. Unselfish. Mule. Takes it back, drives. Nice kick. KK Arnold. Got it. Defended there by Ashlyn Shade. Shade runs, takes the pass, and gets it to go. Becker's quickly closed on by Strandy. She'll drive and bank it off the glass. 18% from three-point range before that shot. Bulldogs four of five from long range. Here's Buell left open for another and buries that one. Oh, she went down hard. Yeah. She's in the ball game. Becker's with the up and in. Becker's to Griffin. Got it at the buzzer. <laughs> to end this first quarter one for one from the floor after the monster game she had on Saturday and immediately has an impact on this one on Monday and that one is going to get stolen away that is Ashlyn Shade with the ball two on two here she'll feed Griffin what a nice move to get to the bucket and draw the foul well Oster to the hoop she couldn't see she does a nice job Creating this turnover, she could have thrown it to her here. Hold on, draw the defense, and then give it to her when she can dribble and shoot and score. Paige likes it. Needs to be con continue to be aggressive offensively. Shade, got it. Uh, the switch came in. Carter missed the uh, foot back. Becker's cut off. The turnaround, got it. Shade, but missed the shot. That was a really good move by Strandy. Shade, left alone, got it. Handle on the ball. Shade to Griffin. The kick. Arnold to Griffin. How about that, the extra pass? Over the top of everything, right to the hands of Arnold. She'll run. Shade with the pull up. yes! Herself moved well without the basketball and got herself open. Two minutes to go in this first half. Five point UConn lead, Brady from the corner. I'll jinx it there by saying that. <laughs> Griffin with the quick hands and the run out. Might put Mule in. I think he put Samuels instead for some offensive firepower. Two second different shot clock and game clock. There's Samuels for three and rattled home. Fans into it behind us here. Yes, they are. Inbound, Edwards. He's a shot by Strandy over the outstretched arms. Of Aubrey Griffin. Randy, eight points on the night. Aliyah Edwards off the glass. Nice. He came in averaging three. Mule from the corner for three. And has been quiet. Second on their team in scoring overall and just got her first points in this third quarter. There's Beckers with a. And not the other team for an open layup. Edwards has it knocked away, draws a triple team. She's getting hit a lot. Find Shade from the corner for three. High is 17. Strandy looking for somebody to throw it to. When she got up in the air, there was nobody there. Arnold. Yes. Timeout. Take it to the rim moment. It's brought to you by Duncan. Well, she keeps her head up, pushes the ball. Nice step away from the defense. Lays it in. They shot the ball in that first half. I mean, their numbers were astronomical compared to what they are on the on the average. It's ridiculous, right? Shade. What a quick release. Well, she was ready for the ball. Trying to post up Brady inside, but Shade will take it from outside and make it her first ready for the ball before she caught and turned she knew she was going to shoot it she saw as are the managers down the other end of the bench Morgan Valley's got a little Nike festive thing there and shade again and that is the largest lead of the night 
for UConn. So 20 to shoot for UConn. They worked on this play a lot at shoot around today. There's Shade. Yes. And speak. Oh, there's a steal. And a score for Griffin. Halfway through quarter number four. Griffin double teamed, looking for the open player, finds it in Samuels. That goes. The shade. She fires to Samuels, almost caught unawares. Nice pass in to Edwards, and it goes. It's for the moment, Edwards. Good movement away from the ball. Take it into the paint and get it to. And a nice salute for this Husky team tonight. Who will extend their record on this season to eight wins against three losses and five and zero oh on their two home courts. Final in Hartford, UConn 88, Butler 62.